फी फाइन और फाइफिन फी फाइन आई थिंक फी फिन माइक्रोफोन दिस हैज माइक्रोफोन लेट्स ओपन इट वाह द पैकेजिंग इज रियली नाइस दे हैव दिस यूजर्स मैनुअल दिस वन and so there is it's like you know foam padding very nice foam padding and when you open it it has this microphone with the stand i think okay, this is how it is so you can put it like this so this is really sturdy mm -hmm, yeah and they have these controls here currently also i am using a for fine one and that one also really nice right the one i am using for fine right yeah that is a uh, lower end this is okay. little bit higher yeah. because it has all the stand and everything right mm -hmm. it's it's really sturdy actually mm -hmm. and then we have your mic mic control uh to control the gain of your microphone and this is the pattern like uh, cardiac conference stereo you know those patterns are like you know if cardiac if pattern is like when you speak you have to speak just here mm. another pattern is stereo means left and right another pattern is you know you can all the microphones will be enabled mm. so if there you want to enable the directional microphone or all around mm. so those are like four modes are there here mm. you can check the users manual for all the four modes so those modes are not there in the lower version so yeah so they are saying that cardioid mm. omnidirectional bidirectional these are all the options mm. can you show them here mm. this is uh, omnidirectional means uh, uh, if you put the microphone in the center from any direction if people speak mm. it will it will capture the voice mm -hmm. so it enables all the direction mm -hmm. now cardioid is only when you are talking from the front mm. and uh, bidirectional is from the left and right mm. so based on the situation you can enable different modes for example if you are in a conference room you can enable the omnidirectional okay. option but if you are doing a interview interview so you can enable the stereo mode like front and back right uh, and that's by direction cardioid means when you are by yourself so that it's very directional yeah. it, it it is helpful because it uh, um, in uh, cardi cardioid it cancels the noise or sound from other direction mm. so it only accepts mm. so it's a directional microphone you know it accepts input from one direction that's pretty much it and everything else is pretty self explanatory here so let's see what's on the bottom so they have a mini usb connection i don't know why they have mini usb they should give usb c here i don't know why they have mini usb mm. they could use usb c lot of manufacturing usb c also they have a, a headphone jack uh, this is a live headphone jack means you can hear your you know input when you speak you can control this can be used to control your gain and then everything so so that you can monitor actually what is your sound output this is this side we have pattern and the microphone gain and this side we have headphone control like how much you want to hear from that headphone jack and then or oh, this is the mute op option if you want to do mute or unmute mm -hmm. that's all so that's pretty much it that's what you, we have and let me see what's inside the box here so they have given this one this one is to connect on the <coughs> bottom i think yeah connect here and then connect this one to something else so other than that they have this what is this let's open this one. oh okay that's the cable to connect the pc yeah so this is a, like a mini usb okay. that's a very old technology i don't know why they are still using mini using mini this USB. one mini usb they should have used uh, they should opt for usb c okay. everybody is using usb c so i don't know that's the only thing i can say that you know i don't like in the design 
this is like mini USB. I, I'm not sure why they are still giving mini USB versus giving USB C. Um, other than that, everything else you saw, and that's all in the package. Nothing else. So on the bottom we have headphone to monitor the output. Mm. This is the uh, input so that you can connect your microphone to the PC. This is a USB microphone so it can only be connected to the devices which can recognize USB. Mostly PC and laptops. And on this side you have a headphone control. Mm. This is mute option. And on this side we have microphone gain control and different patterns that I was saying like bi-directional omnidirectional means all around mm. and then cardioid is like one directional and then the stereo front and back so that's pretty much how you can set these modes and then based on that you can optimize your sound recording quality because if you are on the, you are the only one speaking from one direction you should choose cardioid this is the third option here Similarly, based on your situation, you can choose the option. I mean, that's pretty much it. I don't expect a lot from this microphone. And so we'll see how it works. Okay, so this is the DDR4 RAM, which is a 120 GB uh, combination. It has like four uh, 32 gig modules. And this is from Trident Z Neo. And what I can see here is that this is uh, supporting multiple RGB um, softwares. This is uh, Asus Aura, AS Rock, Polychrome. I have the RGB 2.0 which is from the Gigabyte. And it supports for MSI board uh, RGB also because these RAMs uh, have RGB lighting on them. So let's open it. Okay, so they send me two modules, I think. Okay, this is two. So this is from G Skill, uh, Trident Z Neo. This is from G Skill actually. That's okay. the company. So this looks really nice actually. And let me open it. So each one of them is 32 gig, and uh, this is a 3600 DDR4 uh, RAM. That means the 3600 is the frequency. Is a DDR4 RAM and it the clock is 182242 which is really really good the clock is 18 um, you open it we should not touch it don't touch it here otherwise you can touch here so that's good this is how it looks Trident Z I really like the heat sink here it's a metal heat sink and it, it is really helpful to dissipate the heat and this is the RGB so it's pretty straightforward as you can see I will install and see I hope it works I I already have like 64 gig like 4 16 GB memory modules I am returning all of them in fact I am upgrading so I have to replace those with 4 32 GB memory modules so this sounds a lot but I think it will be for good that I upgraded to the 128 gig. In a way I also wanted to see like my X570 motherboard um, has four um, memory slots. I was trying to max it out and it uh, I found that it supports 128 gig so I just want to give it a try. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, this is here. So you have to get rid of this one, the sticker, and then put that on the glass like that. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm
card this one. I'm not the card I have. Yeah, you can easily uh, make frosted glass with this one. 